Hello everybody, this is Jeff at eTrailer.com. Today we're going to take a look at this Blaylock Aluminum Easy Lock Trailer Coupler Lock for trailer couplers. Now this coupler lock will help prevent theft of a trailer that uses a trigger style, latch style, or hand wheel style coupler. You can see it's a universal fit. It has the three different hole positions, the pinhole positions, that allow for a tight fit of this pin on a variety of couplers. It is an aircraft grade lightweight aluminum construction, it's very strong and resists wear and corrosion. And as we mentioned, this lock is designed to install on most couplers that will fit a 1 and 7 8 inch, 2 inch, and 2 and 5 16 inch diameter hitch balls. Now I do want to demonstrate this. I happen to pull one of the trigger style couplers you can see here as the trigger style that opens the coupler. <clears throat> so we're going to demonstrate on that. So what you want to do is slide this large pin out. It's just a steel pin. And when you go to install this, if you notice the slanted side here of the locks, this will point towards the front of the trailer. So with that pointed towards the front, <clears throat> what you'll do is go ahead and open your coupler, drop it onto the ball, and then go ahead and latch it. And you can see just like that, it's on the lock, and the, and the sides here of the lock will surround the coupler. And then you have the three different sets of holes that you need to slide this pin through. Now this is a three-quarter inch diameter hardened steel pin that will slide through the holes. <clears throat> and it has a hole on this side that you'll lock it in place. So on this one, I'm going to choose this one right here because when you slide it through, you can see how it goes over there. And even if you unlatch the coupler, it won't raise it up. So you still can't take the lock off. So basically, if you have this lock on an unintended trailer, there's no way that a person can be able to hook this up to a hitch ball and drive away with your trailer. So once we choose that position, then what you want to do is slide the pin through and then lock it on this side. Now this lock part number does not come with a lock. We do recommend to use a padlock through that hole there. And you can pretty much use any padlock. What we recommend that works the best is this uh, master lock. It's a part number ML40D. Has a nice hardened steel shank there. And basically what you'll do is just use the keys. The lock comes with two keys. Rotate it to where that shank will open up and then line it up to the hole in the pin and then just go ahead and twist that until that goes all the way through take out your key and then you'll ha have that pin locked into place which will keep anybody from removing the coupler from the lock and then again to remove it just go ahead and put your key in there turn it and that'll remove it from the lock <clears throat> now we do also sell this part with that lock as a part number, so we sell that separate on our website. It's part number BLTL 33 40D. Now, this lock itself is made in the USA. Last thing I want to do is let's go ahead and unhook the coupler. <clears throat> I'm going to give you some dimensions of it and the weight of it. The weight of this is about four pounds with the pin and the lock itself. The width on this is going to be right at six inches wide. Total depth, the widest point. About four and a half inches deep and the total height on it the very top is going to be right at five inches tall but that should do it for the review on this blaylock aluminum easy lock trailer coupler lock for trailer couplers